how to speak like an anime person. Now, first off, obviously, you might need to know how to speak Japanese like me. Now, you might want to put some aggression to it or maybe some calmness, depending on what character you want to sound like. For example, you could be Kageyama from Haiku. Now, he's a little bit aggressive, but sometimes you can have a calming voice, but mostly aggressive. And a type of manly voice. I don't know. So, yeah, I'll use the Kageyama and, yeah. Okay, so first off, you want to get your, like, your voice at a dark toned voice. Right, okay, like this. Ooh, like a, ooh. Right, that's, that's all you've got to do. And then put it all together and it should sound like this. Now, that, that isn't my best because I'm a girl, so I don't have a dark voice, so. Ah, that's just me trying. Now, I could do a haiku because... He is. <laughs> How do I explain this? Like, he's not really a manly character, mainly because he's younger than the other than his other teammates. Cause and he's shorter, and he he sounds like a girl, really. Now, Hinata, um, yeah, like what I said, he sounds like a girl, but he is a very nice and happy character. So for me as a girl, I will just stick to my own voice, but make it a bit more lighter. So if you're a man, you might want, if you're a young man and you haven't hit puberty yet, it is best for you to do it like that. But if you're a man that you hit that, if you hit your puberty, you're done. Right? You can't, you can't do it. It's not gonna sound good if you put like a, just in case even like I have, have like a voice crack. Mainly because he's not manly. Hinata is not manly. One thing, Hinata is not manly. He's just too cute to be manly. Also, Kageyama told um said to um Hinata that he's a human tangerine. Mainly because Hinata's got ginger hair. That that I actually kind of find that a bit mean. But yet again, it was kind of cute because Hinata's response was like cute, angry. It was cute. But yeah. Okay, so here is Hinata's. Oi, oi, oi. Kagayama, go take a sip of the oro. Hi. Go take a sip of the oro. Now here is Kagayama and Hinata. Go take a sip of the oro to go to your ear, but it's scary and buffalo. Hi, my kid is scary and cutting a lot. Motenai. Ke? Ha! Motenai, scurry, cut it, but it's scary and zaba. Go take a sip of Hey, Okay, Okay, so that's it from me and more Japanese videos and stuff like that will be coming soon. So yeah, see ya, later potatoes, boom ya, parao.